These are the craziest world records of all time. Like this jump, this loop, and wait, did someone actually do this? One person's bad idea is another person's world record. Luke Aikens gained his fame by jumping out of a plane at 25,000 feet with no parachute. Momentarily, we'll see his jump team pull their chutes, and that means Luke is all alone for the rest of the way. All that stood between Luke becoming a human pancake was a specially designed net waiting for him just above the ground. A couple feet to the right, and it's game over. Fortunately, this one had a happy ending. This is Ruan Liang Ming, and he holds the record for the heaviest mantle of bees ever documented. It's a strange record to hold, but he regularly gets around carrying up to 140 pounds of living bees crawling all over his body. That's about 637,000 bees calling Lian Ming home. I guess that's one way to get your buzz on. Back in 2019, British stunt driver Terry Grant broke the Guinness World Record for the biggest car loop-the-loop. The loop he drove around is the world's biggest vertical loop at a dizzying 63 feet high. But even with the risk of falling, he managed to pull it off in style. Few extreme sports are as bizarre as sky surfing, but just like with every sport, there are records to beat. Helicopter, helicopter. And Keith Edward Schneider took it upon himself to get the job done. With the pyramids of Giza as a backdrop, Keith jumped from 13,500 feet in the air to attempt the record for the most helicopter spins while sky surfing. With a spin count topping 160, he really did spin his way to stardom. Legendary skier David Wise sure knows an opportunity when he sees one. Gaining speed on the downhill, the Olympic gold medalist hit the jump fast, launching into the air and smashing the previous record by over 10 feet. At 43.5 feet, David now holds the new record for the highest air on a hip jump. It's going to be a tough one to beat. At high speeds, skateboards and their riders often fall victim to the dreaded death wobble. Tell that to Kyle Wester who in 2016 broke the record for fastest speed ever recorded on a skateboard. The professional skater rocketed down the private track in Colorado, hitting an insane top speed of 89.41 miles per hour. He's got plans to go faster though and says it's only a matter of time before he hits 100. Dario Costa has spent two decades impressing crowds as a race and stunt pilot, but it's his latest white knuckle stunt that earned him legendary status amongst daredevils. Firing up his modified race plane, Dario did the unthinkable and flew directly into the mouth of a four-lane highway tunnel. While he didn't have to contend with traffic, there was no room for error. Any problems and Dario would have have less than 250 milliseconds to react to avoid crashing. At speeds reaching 152.2 miles per hour, he came out the other side unscathed and right into the record books. This is the largest ski flying ramp in the Western Hemisphere, towering at a terrifying 24 stories high. Most professional skiers wouldn't even go near it, but Sammy Carlson decided that he would try it facing backwards. Racing downhill with one eye over his shoulder, Sammy flew into the record books as the first skier to hit a ski flying long jump completely freestyle. And thankfully, he lived to tell the tale. One of the most difficult moves in parkour is the dreaded wall flip, but Eric Mukametshin has enough speed and explosive power to make it look easy. On the Chinese show Mission Impossible, Eric showed the world the true extent of his capabilities. With just a short run up, Eric scaled the near vertical 14.4 feet wall and backflipped flawlessly, setting a new world record at the same time. Push-ups are difficult enough on their own, let alone using only one finger. Finger. Zi Guizhong gave himself just 30 seconds to do as many one-finger push-ups as possible, and in that time, he managed an incredible 41 knuckle-cracking repetitions to claim the world record. YouTubers How Ridiculous went all the way to Lesotho, Africa to try and set the record for the highest ever basketball shot. With a hoop set up at the bottom of a waterfall and harnessed ropes for safety, Derek Heron pulled off this amazing basket from 660 feet away. Despite looking like he nailed it on his first throw, it actually took them five days to finally make the shot. Richard Browning isn't just the real-life reincarnation of Tony Stark. He's all about writing himself into the record books. This inventor turned daredevil managed to break the record for the fastest speed in a jet engine suit. Traveling at a blistering 85.06 miles per hour. 
Competing in the world's strongest man competition, contestants had to pull this 44,000 pound plane down the runway with nothing but pure physical strength. Strongman Eddie Hall had a distance of 23.55 meters to beat and pride on the line. Starting strong, it didn't take long for the lactic acid and exhaustion to build up, but Eddie was determined. Eddie Hall weighing 410 pounds, looking very good early with some nice solid leg drive. Smashing the previous record and setting his own with a distance of 24.45 meters. Indonesian speed climber Vedrik Leonardo is so fast at scaling walls, people assume the footage has to be sped up. All those doubts were put to rest at the Speed World Cup when Vedrik set a blistering new record by climbing a 50-foot high wall in just 5.2 seconds. I think I'll take the stairs. Everyone knows that a good jump requires a run-up, that is, unless you're Christopher Spell. With impossible explosive energy, Chris is able to clear heights up to five and a half feet without breaking a sweat. That's taller than some people. This somersault slash headbutt technique isn't pretty, but it's earned him the world record of breaking 111 bricks with his head in just 35 seconds. Limbo is a test of extreme flexibility and balance, but Trinidad's Shamika Campbell has raised the bar by lowering it. Not only can she limbo under a bar just 12 inches off the floor, she's somehow able to propel herself forward using only the inside arches of her feet. To break the record, Shamika traveled an amazing 10.17 feet under 12-inch bars. My back hurts just watching her. Meet Miles Daysher. This adrenaline junkie holds the record for the most human-powered base jumps in 24 hours. What's a human-powered base jump? Well, that just means after each jump, Miles had to climb back up 486 feet just to do it all over again. Each round trip took around 20 minutes, but that didn't stop him from jumping a whopping 63 times. At a total climbing distance of 30,618 feet over 63 leaps of faith, Daysher actually scaled a height taller than Mount Everest in a single day. Finnish stunt driver Vesa Kivimaki raced into the record books with his unbelievable side wheelie speed record. Specially designed tires helped keep the BMW 3 Series balanced while Vesa put his foot on the gas. You can tell it's fast just by looking, but you would have never guessed he reached a top speed of over 115 miles per hour in the process. One of the most revered events in strongman history is the Hercules hold. In this ultimate test of strength, competitors are required to keep two pillars, each weighing 352 pounds off the ground for as long as possible. Despite Mark Felix holding the previous two world records at 54 years old, it was a stretch to think he could do it again, but he didn't disappoint. Smashing his old record, Mark managed to hold on for a whole 1 minute and 32 seconds. 26. 27! It's a world record of 28! Cementing himself into history yet again. Sen Shaolin is the fastest jump roper in the world. He's so fast that when it comes to speed jumping, the record he's about to smash is his own. And while this footage might look sped up, Sen's actually in real time, jumping an incredible 228 jumps in just 30 seconds. Kenichi Ito is a pretty unique athlete. He's become known as Tokyo's Monkey Man, and it's not because of his love of bananas. He's actually the fastest man alive on all fours, recently setting a world record time for his four-legged sprint over 100 meters. At just 15.71 seconds, Kenichi runs on four limbs faster than most of us can on just two.